Hi, it's Kelly Whalen from The Sensible Life, and I'm starting a new weekly project with a great group of bloggers. We're calling ourselves the Vlog Moms, and each week we're going to tackle a different topic for our readers. This week, Desiree, who's from MommyReporter.com, came up with the topic, and it is checking in on your New Year's resolutions. Now, I know not everyone makes them, but I like to talk about <clears throat> my New Year's resolutions every year, because if I put the pen to paper, um, or typing <laughs> to the computer, so to speak, I actually, you know, take it a little bit more seriously than I do if I just kind of talk about it. So my New Year's resolutions this year, I'm just going to kind of pull up my post and look at them and I'll share them with you. Um, number one was invest in my family. And what that means is not just investing money, but it also means investing time. Both of those things are something that a lot of people talk about doing when it comes to business, when it comes to education, but we don't often talk about it when it comes to our relationships with our spouses or with our children. And so one of the things that I really want to do this year is focus on spending quality time with my family and investing in them. So if that means spending a little money on going on a vacation, then I'm going to do that. And so the first week of the year, that's exactly what I did. My husband and I spent a week um, away in Florida, and we just had a wonderful, fantastic time. I'll share a little bit about that um, next week on the blog. But just investing that time together really helped us solidify our relationship and remember, you know, how much fun we can have together without sort of the schedules and the routines and the the mommy daddy stuff going on in the background. So that so far has been fantastic and I think I've been doing a really good job with that. Um, next up were my money goals. There are two of those. First was focusing on paying off our debt more. Um, last year I feel like I, my focus shifted a little bit just because my business was growing, the kids were kind of busy and so it was really hard to focus on household, business, you know, friendships and relationships family and, you know, kind of all the stuff that they need to do as well as focus on really just driving down our debt. We were paying off our debt, you know, it, it was going down, it's going down, the net worth is going up, but I would really like to focus more on just eliminating that completely this year, obliterating it. So we've been doing a great job with that so far. We've gotten rid of one debt already, which I'm super excited about. Um, so one debt down in one month, I think that's a pretty good start. And also the other part of that goal is is kind of goes in hand in hand with some of the goals that I have for my work, just working harder and smarter, spending more time um, working instead of kind of putzing around or trying to figure things out. So being more effective in my work and that gives me more time to spend with my family and more time to actually produce content for you guys and that kind of thing. Um, the other goals are my life goals. Those are goals that are centered around making my life better. So the first one of those was making meal planning a priority. We've been going over that every week though, so I think you guys kind of know I've been doing really well with that. I have made some mistakes, but I'm not gonna give up on this because I feel like it's something that saves us a ton of money in the long run. Um, and I think it's been a great learning opportunity for me and I think it's been really, I've gotten a lot of really wonderful feedback from all of you guys as well that it's really been helpful for you. So that's still a priority, that's going really well. Um, and then there's making me time. And in the first part of this month, I think what that's looked like is, you know, our vacation, but also it's looked like taking care of myself because I've been sick. So that means resting, that means reading a book, that means, you know, sitting on the couch and watching HGTV instead of, you know, kind of trying to do all the things that I would normally do just sitting and focusing on, you know, resting and getting better. So that's where that focus has been. And I'm hoping as I start to get better, which I'm almost there, thank goodness, um, I want to focus more on the, the aspect of, you know, kind of exercise and just sort of self-care, like um, maybe get a haircut for my really long hair that I haven't had cut in I don't know how long, and maybe, you know, just go have some, some relaxing girl time, maybe get a mani-pedi, um, that kind of thing. So I hope that you guys are doing really well with your New Year's resolutions as well. And I would love to hear in the comments what you're up to, how they're going, um, have you given up yet? And link up below if you have a vlog that um, you want to share that with us. We're, we're all linking up so you can go check out everybody else's videos, learn about their resolutions, check out some new blogs. It's going to be really fun. Thanks so much for stopping by.